Hi and welcome to my tutorial on how to record uh, DOSBox games using open broadcast software. And the reason I'm making this tutorial is because I actually struggled um, when I went to record uh, the game appeared in a tiny screen up in the left uh, top left corner and, and even if it was um, full screen on my view it wouldn't record full screen and it was driving me insane and there I found there weren't that many tutorials out there on how to do it so I thought I might wake another one out there um, just to help anybody out um, so first thing you need your open broadcast software you need your DOS box and you need the game you want to play um, I'm assuming you have all this and you really to find out how to record so first thing we do this FYI is very easy um, uh, type in uh, DOS box into your uh, search and this one DOS box options click that now here we have basically um, how to change a whole bunch of options uh, when DOS box loads and <coughs> whatnot um, what we want is this output output should be sent to uh, set to currently something else I can't remember what it was and we want it set to open GL so just type that in open DL and then save and that's that first part of how to do it next open up your open and what we want uh, when we're in here for command like is set the scene command cane and what we want for the sources is actually we just want game capture um, I have monitor capture stuck on as well because um, I'm recording at the moment um, for this we just want game capture click on game capture and make sure the application is set to uh, your DOS box and the game you're playing so keen 5e which happens to be commander keen um, and next make sure this uh, stretch image to screen is set um, with a tick on it so that's all you need all you really need is game capture as a source not monitor capture not video capture not these other bits just game capture remember to set it to stretch and uh, the application set to your DOS box um, and that's basically it so um, I'm going to click on DOS box now and I'm just going to turn off monitor capture now um, here we go so uh, that's it we're in full screen mode um, I'm going to go ahead and just quickly um, mount my game uh, I don't have it mounted automatically so every time um, I come into <laughs> DOS box I need to mount it again I probably should fix that because um, it's not ideal um, also if you're wanting to uh, find out how to mount games um, there are tons of tutorials out there and I'm pretty sure uh, DOSBox even has a like a help thing and it's on Wikipedia and, and there's um, heaps of basically tutorials out there but if you want or it's requested that I show you how to mount games I'll do that as well um, cool so there we go it's all set and ready to go it's let's press the click key and see how it goes um, also if you're wanting to watch uh, your DOS box in full screen um, just press control alt and enter and that should bring up the DOS box to full screen so you can watch it in full screen and it also is recording it in full screen um, hands up if you freaking love commander king <laughs> this brings back tons and tons of memories for me um, yeah so that that's basically it it's so super easy change that um, in the setting uh, in the settings of the DOS box change it to OpenGL um, set your open broadcaster to game capture remember to stretch your screen and make sure the application you're capturing is the DOS box game that's it that's how you do it um, super 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 easy so um, thanks for watching and I hope this helps um, if there's any questions or anything I I can help you out but uh, basically if this doesn't work for you I would be <laughs> slightly at a loss of what to do next um, you can actually record using DOSBox but I actually found that a lot harder than using the open broadcaster software um, I don't know about fraps so um, I think there are some out there for some tutorials out there for fraps um, on how to record using that um, imagine maybe it's slightly the same I'm not too sure 
yeah thanks for watching and i hope i did make some people's lives easier and help some people